Hello, and welcome back to Bard's Tale 3. Uh, this is Jay Rodman, and today we're continuing our exploration of Kinestia. Specifically, we're going into the workshop. So here's our view of Kinestia so far, um, with the Great Hall, or Fervis Hall, the barracks, and this uh, private quarters of Fervis. And we've been sent with the two rings we collected from these two... Not rings. Uh, keys we collected from these two places into his workshop where we are just beginning to explore right now. And the audio is experiencing problems, so I will solve that before I continue. Be right back. Okay, audio issues are resolved. Uh, so let's continue on. After... Restoring my sorcerer site. Always falling off. Actually, let's look at the map. Um, I'm pretty sure this is two more to the east. So I guess I can start drawing that boundary. Uh, to the west uh, is harder to determine. So I guess I'll just stop with that for now. And for sanity's sake, I'm going to verify I'm at the zero coordinate. Yep. Okay. So I suppose I can also do things like... Mark a two. This five I'll leave there for now. One, two, three. That'll be the... Extent of what I'm going to put down for the coordinates for now. Well, okay, I lied. I'm going to fuss a little more, move these outside. Who knows what I'll end up doing them later. Oh, a trap to the east. That I have no idea if it's on this side of the world or not. And I think this is a fight. These are new. Uh, Dejuvenators. I think that's going to make us old. Steel cyborgs. I think they're going to hit us. Geared rangers. I don't. I would think they would shoot at us, but they started at 10 feet away. So I don't know. I'm going to go for the. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to go for. I don't like the idea of dejuvenators. I guess old actually doesn't matter. Um, I'll attack the. Rangers, uh, Kiel's Overture, Hide, Fatal Fist, Angor's Mallet, and the Chintzy Master's Wand. That doesn't cost me any spell points. I will use on the Cyborgs. I'm assuming that's the um, dejuvenators that are breathing and are too far away because everything else is 10 feet away, right? Unless I missed something changing distances. Seems like the dejuvenators are gone, which is fine by me. Well, that was, um, I don't know, if it's, was it less of a challenge than I expected? I guess it was refreshingly easy. I was hoping that I wouldn't all end up old. Becoming old over the years is distressing enough. Becoming old in but a few moments would be, I don't know, unpleasant. 
depressing. Something like that. I don't know why we're all... S it looks like, given the number of hit points we were down across the party, they were very good at spreading out a small amount of damage. Or I walked through a hit point drain and didn't really notice. Maybe it's explosions from before that I've forgotten about. A spinner over that way somewhere. And nothing known to the east. Uh, I'm gonna go west and see if I can locate the spinner. And... Nothing north or south. Haven't gone past a sp I mean, it could be that there's many spinners. Oh, I should zoom the map in somewhat. This is hard to see on a video. And to the north, there's just a wall. Is that right? No, there's three more doors. No spinners, though. Oh, and it can sense the trap to the east, so... Now I know where it's... there's one there. So, into this... this is gonna be like a stable kind of setup. A carbon ripper. Does that mean it's made out of carbon, or like it's like designed to kill carbon-based life forms or something? I think of I don't think of carbon as like a traditional dwarven smith material. But I may be uninformed. A black arrows. Again with the miss the the, the failed agreement should be a some black arrows, a black arrow. I guess putting a flag on items to say whether they were singular or plural was too much processing power. Do I even am I even carrying bows around anymore? I think I'm not. I, think I gave up on them. Mostly because they took up multiple equipment slots. Who's got a bow? Anyone? Oh, I have a bow still on my paladin for some reason. I think I decided to get rid of them. Well, we know what to test out soon on our paladin. Let's go into this little mist area. Oh, you can't walk through a door, that's right. You must open it with your foot. Nothing in this mist area. Okay. Let us go check up on this trap over here. Uh, is that darkness? I don't think that was. My spell just ran out. No spinner here, but yes, spinner here. So, two away from the wraparound, wherever it is. Can I, can I tell more? Oh yeah, I can tell more now. Uh, so not, so one, two, three, so there's a spinner here. Uh, I know where the edge of the world is now. And let's go ahead and mark it, so doop. Some some way up. I'm 
not sure how far I'll need it yet. That's maybe far enough. Okay. And... Looking north, we can see doors all the way. One, oh, doors. One, one, two, three, four. That's the limit of our vision. Okay, drop the trap. Another trap. But not here. There is a trap somewhere over there. Can it be detected from here? Yes. Yes, it can. So... I just accidentally picked some sort of torches on the wall icon. I don't, I don't know how I did that. The trap is there. Okay. And on the edge... On the edge, we will use doors, not not sconce-covered walls. Okay, uh, north? I think I just entered a fight. Cryo guards. Are they going to freeze us? Steel cyborgs. I guess I will stab the steel cyborgs. And... You spell... Spells on the cryo guards. How about flame column? Does, does flame like do extra here? Probably not. They they kind of hurt. I should probably mix a restoration spell in when I'm fighting things I haven't fought before. Flame Column seems to do about as much effective damage as it says in the manual. But that's paltry by this point in the game. Wither Fist on those Cryo Guards and... Um, force Focus on them? Sure. And mix in a restoration. Okay, I think we've won now. I mean, well, I think we ran won from the start to be truthful. But I'm going to stop bothering with spells, I guess. Is what I mean. And my armor class uh, improvement song came too late. Too late. I don't know why I find this so satisfying. Um, this simple arrangement where they show me ahead of time, right? There's like all these doors and pretty quickly I figure out there's going to be a fight behind each one of these doors. And somehow it's just enticing. It's like, oh, let's try them all. Oop, I didn't mean to go there. One, two, three, four, and then these two. I don't know, like, um, maybe it's some common human psychology thing. The, uh, bunch of hidden pockets or whatever, and you want to open them all. It's like an advent calendar. Okay, so, um... From this location, we can see a spinner to the east. One, two, three. And from this location, we can see a spinner to the west, but not from here. 
So, one, two, three. I am confused, said. Oh, I can't see the wall that's to my left. I was looking for this wall, but it's outside your vision in the interior system of viewing of things. Okay, a spinner... that way, to the west, and no spinner to the east, but now spinner to the east. Okay, I just confirmed spinner here, and spinner here. Let's go through some doors. No fight in this cubby hole? Oh no, just delayed. It's loading. Mmm, a collector. What does it collect? I am a little bit afraid of the answer to this question. But I may find out the answer. Um, let's do luck and... Invisibility and anti magic, and there's just not that many of them. I don't think area effect spells are going to help me very much. Although I'll still use Kiel's Overture because whatever. What else is my bard going to do? I don't know. I guess she has other useful things she can do, but. Um, I, I guess in, in that. Now that I have nothing close. I'm going to start shade lancing this collector. They can't reach the uh, other whatever it is from this distance. Bloody masher. Oh, for some reason I decided there was only one Bloody Masher. Are, are they summoning friends, or am I just completely unobservant? I think it's the latter. These Shade Lances will not reach, um, unless they come closer, but I'm expecting them to come closer. And they did. Come closer into my blasts of freezing. They do not seem to resist spells very effectively. Which is good. Uh, I'm going to do a little bit of healing song, I guess. Mixed in with these freezing blasts. Yeah, they're dead. Ten thousand experience, two thousand gold. Griselda found uh, the book. Griselda found uh, the book. Uh, we are doing terrible, terrible Italian spoofs. Um, okay. Next cubby hole. What do you have for me? These are repeats. I shall not keep it in the recording. Oh, just when I was about to run out of spell points. Another harmonic gem. This was just not really a complaint. Mr. Game, I am not complaining. I am simply having a small laugh. Not at your expense. You can keep giving me these harmonic gems, that's fine. I have no problem with that. Um, I think there's a trap here. Oh, I can't sense a spinner over there. Or a 
over here. I wonder if that means that I stepped in an odd square. Well, freezers are freezers are new. Geared rangers kill them. Um, they're at eighty feet, so Godfire on freezer number one. I don't know why I got all those messages about things being too far away, because I mostly did not do anything that required any range. Okay, these feel like enemies that I'm going to have to pull into melee range, or I'll just take far too much damage while trying to blast them with spells. So, stay alive, please, and pull A into combat range. In case it's not obvious, I'm playing the uh, Restore My Hit Points song. Hmm, no items. I'm just kind of hoping for... I don't know, should should I consider that... Should I expect this area to be... I don't know, considered more advanced than the earlier ones. I kind of ex was expecting it to be because the quests kind of sent me this way. I can no longer detect traps? Oh no, I just I, I I should recast my sorcerer's sight. There's probably an odd I stepped on without realizing it somehow. Uh Silver Sam is new. And we've got three of them. No, two of them. I just misread one of these two as it's applying to the Silver Sam. Okay, I'm not very clever. What what do you want? Um Hide in shadows. I don't know if I should... I, whatever, I have plenty of gems. Fatal Fist. Mangar's Mallet. Restoration. Yes. Oh, so now we have our first creatures that just take the 1,000 damage. They're just like, 1,000 damage? Okay. I'm just going to keep going. I, I'm not a big fan of this idea. I think that when I th hit things with a thousand damage, they should stop.
Why do they start at 80 feet away if they don't have a ranged attack? I don't know. I wonder if this is supposed to be um, sort of like Master Tonberries or something, you know, like things that very slowly come up to you and if you don't deal with them before they come up to you, then you're in trouble or I don't, I don't know. That's my theory of the moment. Okay, I'm going to cast Sorcerer's Sight again, now that I'm thinking about it. Okay, they just weren't spinners there, and I just doubted that. Oh, I didn't go in there yet. Here, let's cancel that trap before we step on it. Hmm, there's a little, a little nook. Have we found the edge of the dungeon, actually? We have. Okay, uh, so six, seven, eight. This is not the biggest dungeon. And this is two east, and this is zero east-west, and one, two, three, four... Five west. Six is the limit. Yeah, this is very uh, manageably sized. Let's put down these edges. And remove these. Okay, um... And we need music, and we need light. Oh, I should have looked up to the sides. There's a trap to the east. There's nothing to the west. And I'm loading a fight in this cubby. Uh, brass, brass bashers. I don't know why I struggled to say that one correctly. I'm keeping this in because I don't know what brass bashers do, and I don't know what tin men do. Uh, as always, with things I don't know what they do, they get massive spells dropped on their heads. So one thing Brass Bashers do is attack physically and miss. And I didn't see what the Tin Man did in that encounter. And they also give, well, in small numbers, they give poor experience. Griselda found a youth potion, which I will drop. Elena found an item. Yeah, I bet that's two harmonic gems. I guess I should go ahead and use a harmonic gem. I was trying to... I was thinking to cast one last spell on Elendor, but... I think it will not be... Now, who got the unidentified item? Was it Elena too? 
It was. It is somewhat convenient. Trade that off to Elendor. Scroll down again. Trade this off to Elendor. Nope. Trade this off to Griselda. And trade the last one to Lillian. No. Trade it off to Griselda. No. Okay, hold on to it. I guess I should do a little mapping, uh, and by that I mean draw things I can see before I get really close to them. And on the north, it's fo whoa! I forgot to I forgot to switch back the color too, which is harder to see on these individual lines, but easier to see on the doors. There are a lot of these cubbies. For La Machines! Oh, this got referenced earlier in Galidia. I feel that that is strange. I, I somehow looked into... Well, I guess looking into the future is not so strange in this game. But in any event, uh, I described a scene of carnage in terms of an enemy I had not yet met. That is an odd happenstance. Defend. You can Night Lance them. And you can Master Wand them. They have good resistance. I mean, they have strong resistance that I wish they did not have. Okay, but they only advance 10 feet around. That seems like they're just asking to get nuked down. I wonder how many hit points they have. Well, I've hit the ceiling on some of their hit point capacities, and then some more. I did not mean to do that. I do not mean to use the Holy Hand Grenade. Actually, the Holy Hand Grenade, of course, um, is kind of atrophying, because the further I get along in the game, the more hit points the enemies have. I don't know. It doesn't make me think I should use it right now, though. Uh, Master Wand. So we have one left, and now zero left. Okay. I don't know what to make of them. Again, it's a group of enemies that very slowly advance. That doesn't seem very frightening. Oh, I'm using things on the wrong person. Oh, I can see quite a bit more from here. Because I can see doors here, here, and here. Nothing south. Nothing north. Nothing west. Oh, there wasn't even a fight in that one. 
Or if there was, I left too quickly for it to trigger. Looking south, there's gaps on both sides. Here... Can I see all the way down there? I think I can. One, two, three, four, yeah. Definitely a fight in this one. And nothing new. Hmm. Okay, now we can sense a trap to the west. I keep losing track of whether I'm, you know, like, have I gone, have I, have I updated the map to the correct position? I, and repeatedly when I don't know, the answer is yes, I did, but it's, it's hard to be sure when everything kind of feels the same. Okay, from here I can sense a spinner south, which is not actually a surprise at all. And I can detect a spinner to the north, which I didn't know, but also is not a surprise. One, two, three. And no fight in this cubby, it seems. Or it waited for me to turn? Is that real? <laughs> okay, warbots are new. I'm f well, it's... Er, uh, okay, you reordered them and I got confused a bit. Um, hide. Fatal Fist is, is fine. We can Fatal Fist. Hmm... Um, and you'll just use the Master Wand on the Warbots. So they don't go down against with, with about 400 damage, but they do go down with 1,300 damage, or whatever. More Soothing Balm, and more Shade Lances. Okay, Chantrell and Elena need to drop things. They really should have like a drop button, so I could just say drop and who and not have to load the... Go through the inventory screens and everything. Spinner North, Trap West. And I think I got an, caught in a fight before I got out. Mm, and not an interesting fight. Okay, drop the book from Elena, and then try to remember what I had just detected before I got into that fight. Spinner to the north, nothing south. And an another fight? Oh no, just an offer to join. Spinner south to... Yeah, okay, so... One, two, three... And the one I already placed there. I wonder if there's a spinner in the middle. I don't think I will have any way to ever know. That's slightly annoying. Uh, 
And the spinner to the south, I already know about one. That would satisfy that. And I think I'm going to cut this one a little short because um, I have to do some things in the real world uh, that I didn't plan appropriately for. But I will go into this corner first and notice that there's a trap to the north. And then double check from here, and there is still a trap to the north, so I was just unobservant. And I already kn knew about this trap, or. Yeah, I detected it from the right. Anyway, um, I'm gonna choose not to finish the workshop in this session, uh, but next session, I'm sure that we'll figure out what is going on here, especially what is in the middle of this spinner donut. Spinner square. See you then!